Hello, my name is Jason Miller, founder of Aspen Now Solutions, and we're about to unlock the power of ServiceNow. Just want everyone to know that I'm going to be posting way more videos than I have time to post on LinkedIn. I'll be doing one a day on LinkedIn. So if you can subscribe, you'll be able to get those updates as soon as they happen. So today we're going to continue on with our ServiceNow Certified System Admin Mind Map. And remember that these concepts that we're covering, they can also be used to prepare for an interview. Sometimes they'll ask you navigation questions, so it's very important to understand these questions um, and the answers to them. Um, and some of them might appear on the uh, system admin exam, but um, not really sure. I haven't taken it in about four years, so um, that remains to be seen whether these are the same concepts um, that they used to be. So without further ado, we're going to go to sheet one. And our concept is form. And the two things we want to remember are fields and the record. So if we go to a form, uh, this is our form, our incident form right here. So we see all of our different fields. And then also um, one record, if we were to click into it, um, it would be uh, the, the, the form would pull up. So you would see it there. And I click over it. Yep, basically we have our form right here. So I want to take that and add it to our mind map. And then the next one is a UI policy. And the keywords we want to remember are client side. So if they ask you if something's running client side, we're going to know it's a UI policy. And this is a, as or opposed to whether it be server side. And the UI policy, I've covered that in a video. Um, if you want to take a look at it, uh, there's um, some, some UI policies that I did in, in a video in the past and um, might be able to produce one here. But basically what happens is when we change values, maybe something will appear. There are three different types, so I'll just let you um, refer to the video to, to find the UI policies. Then we're going to move this over here. last concept we're going to talk about is a UI action and it's kind of easy to get it confused with a policy if you're new to ServiceNow so the three things you want to remember are these are more uh, these are more physical items right so buttons links context menu so context menu right here I also refer to this as the hamburger menu so here's our context menu right here um, if we go to our form sometimes at the very bottom this would be a better example. We'll have like these links right here. So this is a UI action. So that's those are two things that we want to look at. And then also our buttons, um, which like at the top of here, um, this would be considered UI action too. So these are different than um, the policy. The policy is basically, um, there are three different types. Again, you can go to the video. So we'll carry this over here. And we'll build on our mind map. So we have, um, yeah, it looks like we have nine items here come along nicely. And um, that's it for this segment. I'm Jason Miller, founder of Aspen Now Solutions. We just unlocked the power of service now. Please subscribe. Thank you and have a great day.